so it's a very moving piece. It's a very evocative piece. Um, it's a piece that that speaks on many levels to our time and uh, and about family, about um, uh, society and society imposing itself on other societies and on its people as well. And depth of the music, the, um, uh, the the haunting kind of quality to it. Um, uh, led us into a world where things loom out of darkness into into being, um, and uh, whether we we end up being across the board that way, it gave a a feeling, and and um, uh, also thinking about um, all the themes of power and how people um, exert power over each other and try to assert, Owen tries to assert his individuality in the face of that um, <coughs> exertion of power by the family, by the military, um, by society um, in the larger sense. We thought about Grand Staircase, which is such a central feature of, of uh, English estates, and how also a stairway um, conjures up just by use of space, um, relationships and people being on top versus below, um, about being uh, intruding into a space or fleeing from a space, that, that there are a lot of different um, uh, feelings um, in movement that you can use a, a stairway for. The, the architecture um, uh, involved and in, in architecture is often power. It often um, shows one's uh, status in life and uh, so a, a grand staircase um, is a different beast than, than a, um, uh, a small utilitarian uh, stairway. So, um, so in, in keeping with what we were feeling about the piece, we thought that there is some is some scale to this that's that's maybe unrealistically large for um, for an English country manner, um, but is sort of about staircase ness um, more than a specific realistic uh, uh, staircase. Ken felt that that it was a strong piece in this time period and in a time of a lot of a lot of social constriction too that that reinforces even more the, the themes and the costumes physically uh, restrict people um, uh, both the men and particularly the the women of course at the same time uh, um, it can be beautiful you know watching the the flow of a, of a woman moving moving upward and and um, uh, on on a you know an ascending uh, uh, stairway, um, and also that that um, there's a a certain care and preparation that a woman needs to take whether she you know has to think subconsciously about hiking her skirt slightly and so forth that that um, that emphasizes the fact that the clothing of this period um, could be as as much. Uh, encumbrance as fashion, and even though it was, was passing out of the high Victorian into the Edwardian period and, and uh, not as, as heavy with the bustle and so forth and, and frankly artificial um, to our modern eyes as, as, as Victorian uh, fashion was, um, uh, there's also an elegance to it in its restriction. Um, so um, I think it's you know, flattering um, to men and to women. I think COT certainly is an, is an artistic home, has been a wonderful artistic home for, for both Ken and me um, in that, uh, that, that Brian and the entire staff are very in, encouraging of, of discovering um, interesting, often new ways into pieces um, 
that have been done before um, <coughs> um, that um, that there's a, um, a theatrical um, uh, kind of a license that this company encourages to to find um, uh, the find a way that goes into a piece in not necessarily a, a straight predictable line. 